Hello, and welcome to Cinema Blend's Daily News Roundup, where we tell you what stories are hot in our world. Batman fans have been stoked for Ben Affleck to direct the Cape Crusader's next solo film, but news that he is stepping down is our number four story. While he is still attached to Star as Bruce Wayne, he will no longer be directing and announced it with this statement. There are certain characters who hold a special place in the hearts of millions. Performing this role demands focus, passion, and the very best performance I can give. It has become clear that I cannot do both jobs to the level that they require. Together with the studio, I have decided to find a partner in a director who will collaborate with me on this massive film. I am still in this, and we are making it, but we are currently looking for a director. I remain extremely committed to this project and look forward to bringing this to life for fans all around the world. In at number three is Kellyanne Conway's feelings about her portrayal on Saturday Night Live. Kate McKinnon plays the Donald Trump campaign manager, and Conway herself said this about how she wishes to be portrayed. Actually make her be a little bit more happy. I'm known as much more happy than maybe the character sometimes is. I liked the walking on sunshine. I liked the Kellyanne Conway's day off. That was much more me. In at number two is an update on the Han Solo anthology film. If you're a fan of the Star Wars franchise, you are aware of the Han shot first debate. It is in regard to Han shooting Greedo and whether or not it was self-defense. Well, it was referenced by director Chris Miller when he posted this on the film's first day of shooting. Han first shot, haha, <laughs> very clever. And our number one story of the day is about expanding the number of games on the Nintendo Entertainment System Classic Edition. This gray box jam-packed with nostalgia comes stocked with 30 games, but it looks like a hack is allowing players to take that number up to 84. Apparently, it's been attempted to take it a step further, as it's also been reported that packing the system with more than 90 games will cause it to crash. And those are just some brief overviews, so make sure to check out those stories as well as our other fabulous articles right here at CinemaBlend.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.